plastic out. Okay. There's the mount. That's the whole thing. Sealed unit. Now it's got a little couple of air holes here. That's the directions. Plug and play. Set it up, plug it in, call it a day. Ours is going to go in the tower. Not underground. Here's all the cable, which is more than enough. And where's the box? Okay, so that's the antenna, well, little plastic thing, little black plastic thing, and the magic box. So it goes inside a... This is like the router, yeah. That goes in the house. Right there. It's pretty weird. How's it set? Oh, it's got a box. Ah, okay. See that? It's got a feed like that. That. You're moving it too fast. I'm not. I'm not that fast. I'm slow. That's it. Then this, the end of this cable, the end of the antenna, right here. We'll plug into this. Oh, that's not right. Oh, it goes way up in there. See that? And then it goes. Let's go this way. See? So it's all covered. And that's where you will hook up to. But now, I've got to pull down the other antenna. Okay. So there's your unboxing. Now it's mounting to our existing system. Because this is going to get mounted into. You're going to remove the reboost? Yeah. For now. It's not working right anyhow, is it? Okay. So we're going to remove the reboost. Let me get the. And we're gonna try the Starlink. Starlink is still collecting data on obstructions. They use it. This usually takes about 12 hours. Yeah, this is the speed test of it by um, the Okla. Try right here, look. Bang! It's like, oh my gosh, that is fast.
So, for this Starlink, they make a special mount which is like 50 bucks for an adapter. I chose to go a different route. So, we bought a, uh, what's this, uh, a 12 inch drain. Uh -oh. What's going on? It's moving now because I screwed it up. And we're going to mount that as an insert in our pole to this. Starling. I'm going to take this off. Take. Mount it in here. You're going to pull okay. that. Yeah. Just for a second. Drill a small hole. Make sure you're not gonna drill the antenna. Huh? Take the, the screw. Gently put it in. Into the starlight. Voila. Now you're able to go up to 25 feet to clear trees if need be. So then we'll take and mount it on our, probably gonna have to bring some of this, on our RV. to clear trees in the way. The speed is phenomenal on this. This is the tele telescoping. Is this is a telescoping from our yeah. uh, WeBoost antenna. Yeah, you can send it. Put the link in there for me. It's probably one of the best things I've bought. So that's the JNLS. Um, name of our network on Starlink and I'm going to check the speed of it. Test connection. Oh my gosh, look at that guys. It's 7729 KBS. Holy cow. That is so fast. And just the quality of the video, the TV is so much clearer. Before when we're using our uh, Verizon jetpack or a hotspot on our phone, or on either T-Mobile or Verizon, it is not clear like this. This is so much clearer. Thank you. 